Hey guys, welcome to LZH Project. My name is Salman Francis and this is our second video of our Solaris edition. And in this video, we are going to talk about some basic networking in Solaris. So let's start. So in this session, we will take a look at Solaris networking techniques. And in this uh, video, we will talk about DHCP and static IP assigning. So first, let me take you to the our Solaris box. Okay, we have here our Solaris box and you can see that we can easily ping our gateway. We can easily ping our uh, Google DNS and any external IP. But sometimes it's give you problem with pinging, for example, the names. Okay, and the solution is to first assign this uh, Solaris box as a DHCP and then you can easily delete it. The main idea is to delete the current IP scheme and reassign IP via DHCP or static. So let me uh, walk you uh, guys step by step how to do that. So let me go back to our um, presentation. So first thing is we need to see how to check the physical ethernet and that is with the command dladm okay so let's take a look d okay first let me see, uh, switch to as a user root okay the command is dladmin or dladm okay and show that phys so this means show me the physical interfaces. So as you can see, it's showing you that the link is net zero. Media is ethernet state is up at the moment and the speed and the duplex and the device. Also it's E1000 G0. Okay, good enough. Now, next command is to show the link. That's the same way like DL admin show link command. And the main idea behind this is to see the MTU or um, this link because you can see that net zero is there, class is uh, PHYS, physical, state is up, and MTU stands for maximal transmit uh, unit. So that's 1500. Okay, good. Now let's move. To our next slide and here we can see how to uh, set IP address first thing we are going to create the IP address with the command IP ADM this time it's IP admin you can say IP ADM create IP address then uh, first thing it is going to prepare for the interface then we are going to assign it with DHCP okay so let's check right at the moment what is currently available IP ADM and you can see at the moment it has static IP it's 192.168.1.30 and what I'm going to do is I am going to remove it so to delete it first I'm not going to assign it like I can get the same uh, like at the moment at the same time I can get DH, uh, IP via DHCP and static but I don't want to do that so IP ADM, okay. So where uh, the command is create to delete it, we are going to just delete, use delete command. D-E-L-E-T-E, -E -E, delete IP. Okay, from where? From net zero. Let's check if it works. IP ADM and perfect, it worked. So now you can see that we are clean, we cannot ping any of the IP right now because uh, the IP is deleted and it's gone. Let's clear the screen. Okay, now first thing what we need to do before we start this DHCP, we are going to use IP admin command and this time we are going to create IP and if you remember from that link, we know that the ethernet is net zero. If you are not sure about that, you can always check with 
DLADM. And here you can see the link is net zero and that's your physical interface. Okay, so now let's go back. IP ADM create dash IP for net zero. Okay, now let's check if IP ADM is, okay, you can see that net zero is now available, but you can see it's down, okay? So what we are going to do is, this time we are going to assign it an IP address. But since it's a DHCP, we are going to use the command uh, as per the slide. So let me show you that. This is the command we are going to use, IP ADM create address. Dash T means the type, T DHCP, and where we are going to use it on net zero. So let's do that, IP ADM. Very simple, create ADDR dash T and net zero and DHCP. So that's how we are going to use it. You can uh, mention it with forward slash DHCP, but this will also work. So press enter and it's trying to get its IP address. Okay, let's clear the screen. IP ADM shows that it has successfully, you can see here, uh, 192.168.1.131 uh, is the new IP address. It has successfully uh, taken its IP address via DHCP. Okay, can we ping our gateway? 168.1.1. Okay, perfect. Let's check if the route uh, of our machine netstat hyphen r and you can see that the default gateway is 192.168.1.1 okay that's fine uh, and ip address is 192.168.1.131 okay clear can we ping external ips yes we can now can we ping google yes we can can we ping yahoo Yes, we can. We can ping everything. Can we ping our website at pings.com? Perfect. So this is how you can easily assign IP address to your Solaris machine via DHCP. Okay, what's next? Okay, you can also check IP address details with IP ADM command. Yes, you can. Okay, so here is one, other, uh, one more command. Uh, IP admin to show IF is for interface. It's just to check if your interface state is up and what kind of state uh, interface is available. So let's take a look at that. IP admin show if. And you can see we have loopback interface and net, um, net zero interface, which is our Ethernet. Okay. Uh, more commands to check. Uh, IP admin show address will give you the address. Okay, and it will also tell you uh, what kind of uh, it's also going to show you if it's available, like DHCP is available or not. So IP ADM show ADDR. And you can see that the type it's showing you that the type is DHCP. Okay, perfect. Okay, now we are going to delete again this IP because we need to uh, use our next uh, scenario where we are going to uh, use uh, static IP. Um, we, uh, where we are going to assign uh, our Solaris machine with the static IP. So first we are going to delete the IP address again with IP ADM delete dash IP net zero. Okay. So let's do that. IP ADM delete IP and net zero. IP ADM and you can see that everything is gone again. IP ADM show dash if will reveal that only loopback is now available. 
Okay, now to assign it static, the system is same. All we need to do is just change the type from DHCP to static and then mention the IP address also. For example, IP ADM. First, we are going to create IP for net zero. That is the first thing. This time, if we check the interface, we can see now the interface is available, but the state is down. Okay, now we are going to use the command. Let me show you the command. IP ad admin or IP ADM create dash dash uh, dash ADR dash type is static. Same thing net zero and then the dash A is for address. So the command is IP ADM create dash ADDR. First we created IP. Now we are creating the address of type static that is important where we are going to create it on net zero what is the address we are going to give it address like say 1.131 and this time you can see that the state is up and it's active clear IP ADM only will reveal that the everything is okay can we ping 4.2.2.2 yes we can can we ping google perfect can we ping it pings.com yes we can so that's how you are you can easily give uh, your solaris box ip via dhcp or via static means